This is a semi-autonomous 5 degree of freedom robotic arm controlled by Arduino Mega. Equipped with a couple of SRO4 ultrasonic sensors and 5 servo motors, this robotic arm can access more space as compared to the 3 or 4 axis robotic arm. This robotic arm can even map the surrounding by counting the number of objects that lie in its vicinity and also determining their respective polar as well as Cartesian coordinates. Mapping of the surrounding and inverse kinematics detailed video will be uploaded in the second part as this video is going to be all about trajectory planning. Using the trajectory planning algorithm and inverse kinematics, this semi-autonomous 5-axis robotic arm can follow path and specific orientations in space as specified by the user's programming. Now, using the trajectory planning algorithm, the robotic arm moves in space such that the third link of the arm executes a back and forth motion along a straight line parallel to the XY plane. In this case, the three links of the robotic arm rotate about their respective axis of rotations in such a way that the end point of the second link of the robotic arm executes a straight line motion parallel to the XY plane and the third link that is the gripper of the robotic arm remains perpendicular to the XY plane and it executes a back and forth motion. So, here is the demonstration of the straight line motion of the arm. This semi-autonomous robotic arm moves fast and it's highly stable and reliable. Apart from the horizontal straight line trajectories, this 5-axis robotic arm can even follow vertical straight line trajectories in space. Using the trajectory planning algorithm, the three links of the robotic arm moves in space in such a way that the third link, that is the gripper of the robotic arm, executes a back and forth motion normal to the XY plane. During the course of this motion of the robotic arm, the ultrasonic sensor S1 follows a vertical path such that the ultrasonic pulse generated by that sensor propagates through space parallel to the XY plane and hence this motion of the 5-axis robotic arm can be used to determine the height of the object which lie in the vicinity of the arm. So let's freeze the time for a moment and get the feel of what exactly happens in space. Apart from the horizontal straight line and vertical straight line trajectories, this robotic arm can also follow a general straight line trajectories in space using the trajectory planning algorithm. Let's freeze the motion of the robotic arm in space for a moment of time and visualize the actual trajectory that has been executed in space. This angle theta can take any value from minus 90 degree to plus 90 degree autonomously using the inverse kinematics in those cases where the object's orientation around the robotic arm are simple whereas in those cases where the object's orientation around the arm is complex the value of the angle theta can be assigned in its programming to execute the desired general straight line trajectory in space